Welcome to the Honda Power Equipment video, How to Operate Your Honda EU3200i Generator. In this video, we'll show you how to operate your generator properly and safely. Operating a generator can be dangerous if used incorrectly. Always refer to the owner's manual regarding safe and proper operation of this generator. Generator exhaust contains carbon monoxide, which is a poison you can't see or smell. Never use a generator in an enclosure or inside a home or garage, even if the doors and windows are open. Only use it outside, far away from windows, doors, and vents. Now let's get more familiar with the exterior of the generator and identify some key parts. Fuel filler cap. Maintenance cover. Starter grip. Muffler. Spark plug maintenance cover. Handle. Under grip. On the front of the generator, you'll find the following controls and features. LED indicators. On-off switch. Circuit protectors. Eco throttle overload reset switch. 30 amp twist lock receptacle. 20 amp receptacle. CO minder. Parallel operation outlets and the ground terminal. Let's explore each of the LED indicator panel lights a bit further. Fuel level, power output, oil alert, overload alert, eco throttle, Bluetooth. Adding fuel to your generator should be done in a well-ventilated area away from sources of flames or sparks and always wipe up any spills immediately. Make sure that the engine is off and cooled, then remove the fuel filler cap and carefully fill the fuel tank up to the red upper level mark on the fuel strainer. Reinstall and tighten the fuel cap until it clicks. Wipe up any spills. Always check the oil level in your generator before each use. To prevent a possible fire, keep the generator at least three feet away from building or trailer walls, vehicles, boats, and any other equipment during operation. Do not place flammable objects close to the engine or exhaust. Be sure that all appliances or devices are disconnected from the generator before you start it. Starting the EU3200i is a super easy two-step process. First, turn the engine switch to the on position. Next, pull the starter grip lightly until you feel resistance, then pull briskly away from the generator. Return the starter grip gently back to the generator. The Eco Throttle system remembers the last setting selected when the generator was turned off. If you don't wish to use the Eco Throttle system, push the Eco Throttle switch to Eco Throttle System Off. To stop the engine in an emergency, simply turn the engine switch to the off position. Under normal conditions, turn off or disconnect all appliances that are connected to the generator first, and then turn the engine switch to the off position. The EU3200i is equipped with a CO minder system that is designed to shut off the generator when high levels of carbon monoxide are detected around the generator. When the engine is automatically stopped by the CO minder, Move the generator to an area with fresh air and away from any device that may be emitting carbon monoxide, such as another generator. Press the CO Minder Reset button and then follow the standard procedures for starting the engine. When the CO Alarm Indicator or the Fault CO Minder Life Indicator flashes, press the CO Minder Reset button to turn off the indicator. Understand that after the engine is stopped by the CO Minder, the generator cannot be restarted for approximately 30 seconds. Generators are a potential source of electrical shock. Never expose the generator to moisture, rain, or snow. Don't operate the generator with wet hands or remove any of the generator covers while it's running. The two AC receptacles can supply power to common household items that operate at 120 volts and require less than 3200 watts or 20 amps of power. Before connecting an appliance to the generator, verify that it is turned off, in good working order, and that its electrical rating doesn't exceed that of the generator. 
Once the generator is started and the green output indicator is illuminated, voltage is present at the receptacles. Plug the appliance into the corresponding receptacle, then turn the appliance on. If the red overload alarm light illuminates or the circuit protector trips, the appliance may require more electrical power than the generator is able to supply. It may have a short circuit or an internal fault. The power to the receptacles will be stopped until the fault has been fixed. Unplug the appliance and recheck the appliance to verify that the generator's specifications are not exceeded. The EU3200i generator is equipped with the EcoThrottle system, which automatically raises or lowers the engine speed depending on the electrical load for lower noise and improved fuel consumption. To use the EcoThrottle feature, simply press the EcoThrottle switch in. When EcoThrottle is on, the green indicator will illuminate. Some appliances and tools with higher startup power demands may not operate correctly using the EcoThrottle function. Confirm that the appliance or tool does not exceed the capacity of the generator, and in the event the tool or appliance does not function properly, turn the EcoThrottle off and retry. For additional information regarding the operation of your EU3200i, refer to your owner's manual or contact your Honda Power Equipment dealer.